Hey everyone, my name is Kaushal Malkan and you're watching Tech Whoop. So, you have decided to mirror your Android screen right to your PC, but you don't know how to do it, right? Well, look no more. I've got three different ways through which you can do it. The first one is called Windows Connect and this is by far the easiest way to do it. It is completely free and it is already built in in your PC. So the first thing you need to do is turn on your PC. But before that, make sure that both of your devices are Bluetooth enabled and paired with each other. I'll just wait here until you do it. Done. The first thing you need to do is click on your start button. After that, go to the settings option and then choose system. After that, Click on projecting to this PC and from the first drop down menu, click on available everywhere. That's all you had to do it on your PC. Now open up your Android device, click on settings and click select more network. After that, scroll down all the way and select screen mirroring. Once you have done that, a whole list of options will come out which are available to screen. So once you select your device from the list, click on it and that will pair them together. A request might also pop up on your desktop end and where you have to click on the yes button to pair them. Now you have done with your screen mirroring and you want to terminate it. So how to do it? It's very simple. Just click on your settings, go to screen mirroring option and click on end connection. That's it. It will send you a confirmation dialog. Click on OK and you are done. But this was only one of the ways through which you can do it. There are also multiple third party apps through which you can also do it. But my top three picks from them would be Visor, all cast and a power mirror. I'll link all of them in the description for your ease and you can definitely check them out. Personally, my favorite is Visor and I would recommend using that. But to be very honest, there are a lot of ads on these and there are also watermarks present. So if you want a seamless experience, I would really recommend you to use the Windows Connect option through which you can do it easily and smoothly. Now coming to the third and the final method, this is not technically screen mirroring, but it definitely like lets you control your mobile device through your PC. And this one is called AirDroid. All you have to do is install the app on your phone and open web.airdroid.com. Once you have done that, a QR code will be generated on your screen and you just tap on the QR option on your app and scan the code. And that is it. Your PC and your phone are already connected. But there is one little thing that you have to make sure is that your phone and your PC both have to be on the same Wi-Fi network. If that is true, you don't even have to log in or do anything. It will just connect your mobile to your PC and you can easily control and transfer files on the go with very high speeds. So those were three different ways through which you can screen mirror your phone to your PC. I hope it helps you out. And if you have any doubts, please let us know in the comments and we'll definitely make a video about it. Thank you for watching my video. Like, share and subscribe to techwoop.com. Also check out our website, link in the description. And if you dislike the video, hit the thumbs down button. And if you liked it, you know what to do. So cheers.